what's up everyone? I just recently started to organize an EDC since my husband and I regularly go camping every month. I have two versions of this, the essentials and the emergency kit, but for today, let's focus first on my EDC emergency kit which I bring whenever I'm traveling or out of my comfort zone where resources might be limited. Let's start off with my first aid kit that includes a few strips of Band-Aid and Paracetamol. Band-Aid is useful to cover up minor cuts, blisters, and wounds. Of course, this is just a temporary solution to prevent infection and bleeding, so make sure to treat your wound properly to heal it completely. I don't usually take medicine when I'm sick, but in case of emergencies where I don't have access to alternative natural remedies, I bring a few pieces of paracetamol to be relieved from body pain, headache, or fever instantly. Just be mindful to always check the expiration date of your medicine. Next would be my Lucas Papau ointment. I really like this product because it has a lot of uses. It is a convenient remedy for boils, burns, cuts, cracked skin, splinters, open wounds, or insect bites. During my winter trip, this saved my lips from cracking as it really helped to moisturize dry skin. Then I have my Nightcore flashlight. I know at this age and time, I can always use my phone's flashlight feature but in case of emergency, and want to save my phone battery's life, it is always useful to have a compact light in case of a blackout. This is also useful when I'm trying to find something in my bag when inside the theaters or somewhere dark. I chose this particular flashlight which is battery operated instead of a rechargeable one because I can store a battery backup even if I'm not using it for a long time. The battery holds its charge pretty well compared to a rechargeable one and I can buy a AAA battery from any convenience store. Then I have learned to bring along a whistle in case I want to use it to call for help or grab an attention because you'll never know when you need it. I also bring a AAA battery for my flashlight just in case I need to use it longer. The next item from my bag would be my Leatherman Multi-Tool. It has scissors that I use when opening small packages, cutting loose thread on my clothes, cutting out cable ties, or tags of my newly bought items. It also has a bottle opener. It also has pliers where I can use it for gripping something or twisting and cutting out wires. It also comes with a flat head screw. For example, you can use it when changing batteries for your gadgets, toys, or equipment. It also has a nail file, which I can use to shape the edges of my nails, or just simply to quickly, easily clean my finger or toenails. This multi-tool also has tweezers where I can use to remove and pick up small, delicate items. Splinters can really be painful and annoying, so having tweezers on hand is a relief. Or actually use it to clean my eyebrows.
I'm not a smoker but I bring a lighter in case I need to start a fire. Lastly, I always bring cash on hand in case I need to buy something important from the drugstore or convenience store or pay for a public transportation to make my way home. To conclude, I have 10 items in my EBC emergency kit. What can you say about my kit? Do you have any recommended items for me to add? I'm also currently looking for a more compact and quality EBC bag. Maybe some of you can suggest a good brand for me to try. I would appreciate your comments and feedback below. Thank you and I hope you can watch out for my EBC Essentials video soon.